What's up guys, it's me SG, welcome back to another Red Dead Online video and this is pretty much a two in one solo money method and by doing this you're going to get good, very good money and very good XP and a bit of gold. It's always a bit of gold, you know, gold is the least we probably earn in the game. Um, but what we're doing guys is this you know this is a few methods that I, I do when I play the game to really maximize my my profits with money and XP and what we're doing is so this is a solo two-in-one method we're basically taking on two roles in one and I like what I like to do guys is I like to do bounty hunter missions right we're doing bounty hunter mission and at the start of most, it dep obviously depends on the bounty hunter mission you have. Um, sometimes you've got to be a lot quicker than others, but a lot of the time you can actually take your time. And as you can see at the top of the screen, guys, there's no timer. No timer has started. So we could take as long as we want and the mission will not fail. And as you can see on my character's hand, guys, I have the metal detector out. While I'm on my way to the bounty target, I will you know I will just gallop take my time and any vibrations the metal detector will detect it and I will go and get that collectible before I even get to my bounty target guys and by doing this you can you can actually collect around five to eight maybe even ten depends where you are on the map and you will get around that you know five eight maybe ten collectibles while just in a bounty mission and this and you know if you think about it guys you'll get paid for the bounty mission and you will also say you get eight collectibles you go and sell those eight collectibles you'll put you're earning probably 80 to a, maybe a hundred dollars per bounty hunt mission as well as the XP and gold you get for the actual bounty mission and what I'd also recommend guys is to when you actually have the bounty you know the bounty hunter target when you have the bounty target you know and you're making your way back to the drop off what I would do any enemies just stop what you're doing shoot the enemies kill the enemies and loot them because that way you're going to get even more money and you could also end up collecting a collectible off of a looted body which that is the case for me on many bounty hunter missions and you know guys as you can see I've got the bounty target on my horse and you know I've worked out the location of where I'm going and I have enough time to collect this collectible and you will find guys sometimes you'll have the bounty target and you know your destination where you have to take the bounty target is not far but you still have like eight minutes on the clock guys just roam around while you have the bounty hunter target because the longer you're in the mission the more you actually get paid from the mission itself but on top of that you're also finding collectibles before the mission's up it's amazing guys you, you know this is what I do this is and I'll be I get asked a lot of questions on my videos how do you have so much money you know how do you have some you know your ranks really high your gold's really good gold I do everything I'm showing you in the videos today and previously I do all of those methods as well as I also take take on the date every time I log into Red Dead Online the first thing I do is the daily challenges I don't do every single one but I do the majority of of the daily challenges that are pretty much quick and easy enough to do and that stacks up my my gold you know and then I'll start doing these money methods and you know if you're new to the channel I've got a lot more money methods on my channel go check it out there's they're pretty good I've got a very good one for um, doing collectibles um, I have two for the collectibles actually I've got a map to map method and also a method using no maps but everywhere you go in the game guys click your two le uh, click your two analog sticks in every five to ten seconds everywhere you go whether you're in the trader role you're doing a bounty hunter mission or you're simply free roaming click your two analog sticks in because eight times out of ten there's going to be a visible collectible near where you are but on top of that as well as you know pushing in the analog sticks have your make it a habit to yourself to have the metal detector out 
all the time unless obviously you've got enemies on you or anything like that you know then you can't but even if you're just roaming around or in a bounty hunting mission or in the trader role have your metal detector out at all times because the second your metal detector starts vibrating you're near a collectible and you just need to roam around that area until you pinpoint it like that and guys this is I'm doing this while I'm in a bounty hunt mission so I'm getting paid from the bounty hunt mission as well as collecting all these collectibles I'm also getting XP per collectible I collect as well as the mission itself if enemies come after me I get XP per kill I get more money for killing them and I get a collectible I also get a collectible oh that was close he nearly ran away <laughs> um, but I think I've got him just in time um, but yeah guys you know do exactly what I've done in this video if you really want to grind the game and I like doing methods because that way you're still having fun you're getting to enjoy the game for what it is and you know it's as easy as that guys and if you like the video drop a like if you you know if it's not for you maybe dislike entirely up to you guys um, subscribe to the channel if you are new don't forget to hit the bell for my latest content like this and also for everyday Madame Nazar's locations as the majority of you know I post her location every day now but guys as always I appreciate the support and I appreciate your time and I appreciate you tuning in as always thanks again I'm SG and I'll see you guys in the next video